This is Elizabeth. I am calling to inform you that more humans have wandered into Tartarus. Two this time, I believe. Please swiftly and safely conduct a search and rescue. Goodbye now. Family is special. 
you think I'll have a family of my own one day? Yeah, you're right. I hope. So, um, when I'm all grown up, can we get married? <gasps> really? You promise? <laughs> Take this, okay? I made it just for you. Someday, let's get real wedding rings. I am thou. Thou art I. The bond thou hast nurtured hath finally matured. The innermost power of the hanged man arcana hath been set free. We now bestow upon thee the ultimate form of the hanged man within thyself. Again, okay? I just know it. Welcome back. Today, I'd like to make a snack food that would pair well with tea. And that said, I'm not terribly well-versed in the art of cuisine. So I'm hoping to make some simple karumeyaki. Did your teachers ever show you how to make it? Excellent. Then I don't need to explain. All right, let's get started. Temperature control is key. We want to turn off the heat right before it hits 130 degrees Celsius. Oh, we should keep things moving. Let's put the sugar in the ladle first. What a nostalgic flavor. It may not require hours in the kitchen, and the taste isn't particularly complex, but I'm quite fond of these. And more than anything, it's nice that we can make it ourselves. You know, when I saw this for the first time, I thought it was like magic. I've tried making it myself a number of times, but I ended up burning it on every attempt. I guess you could call it a bittersweet memory. But I didn't give up. I continued practicing. And that's finally led to our success today. What do you think? Hearing you say that makes me glad to have shared it. Back home, there were plenty of opportunities to host formal dinners and tea parties, but I never considered it particularly admirable to have someone else prepare the extravagant dishes. Doing the cooking myself also allows me to talk with you like this. And isn't that sort of familiarity the key to understanding each other better? I think... 
This might have been what I was missing. Instead of complaining about being difficult to approach, I needed to create an opportunity for change. <laughs> it's fascinating the kind of things you learn by simply inviting someone over for tea. Thank you. I hope we can talk again like this sometime. Oh, right, I had a favor to ask. There's still some sugar and baking soda left. Do you think you could help me make another batch? Karameyaki keeps for a long time. This could be a good chance to make some for the others. Recognize that shrill grating voice anywhere. I mean, who wouldn't? I don't have all the free time in the world like you high school kids, so let's try to keep this short. My son gave you money that was supposed to pay for his cram school. I'd appreciate it if you'd give it back. Let's just be done with this. I won't bother you again if you return the money now. Are we good? Um, look, sir, I don't think you have the full picture here. Your son said he hates cram school. That's why he was hiding in the park by himself. I was doing him a favor. If anything, you should be thanking me. Right? See, he thinks so too. Well, what's this? Someone sure is bold today. You sure you're not gonna start screaming emergency and run away? My, my, you really don't have a clue, do you? No wonder you don't understand how your son feels. Besides, haven't you heard? He's my bodyguard now. Look, I should be the one forgiving you. And even if I did, there's no way you're getting into paradise. People like my dead brother, non-believers like you, you're not welcome there! <sighs> Talking to you gives me a headache. You know my son, right? He's still in elementary school, and yet he has a better head on his shoulders than you do. Your parents have my sympathy. I'd be ashamed if my son were as neck deep in this cult as you are. What? What did you just say to me? So that's how it is, huh? You're just like the rest of them! You think I should have died instead, don't you? You don't think I'll ever hold a candle to my twin brother, do you? Just knock it off. Damn kid. God, this has been such a waste of time. Fine. If that's how you want to play, then just you wait and see. Better watch yourself, kid. Hang around this guy for too long, and he'll scam you, too. I tell my son the same thing. Choose your friends carefully. Now excuse me. You've learned a little respect. 
Uh, actually, don't come back! Ever! We won! We fought that guy off! As long as you're here, I've got nothing to fear! All right! I was dying of hunger, wasn't I? Come on! 